Hey, I'm Scott. Welcome to my channel, Scotty's Record Room. We're in the Mojave Desert right now. Right behind me over there is 29 Palms Military Base. This is my little cabin in the desert. And right here I have my vintage uh, record player equipment. Okay, so this is a vintage Rotel. This right here is a Fisher RS 1035. Um, and um, all of these little IKEA boxes are uh, my records. I have a lot of interesting music from around the world. I have a lot of bluegrass and um, American music of all types. You, it, amazing. I've, I've really focused on, on collecting American music, whatever that means. Um, I've got classical, I've got jazz, I have it all. All of these records, um, each one of these uh, bins is full, and I believe each one of these bins is about, a I can fit about 100 records. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, so about 1,100 records. And then I have uh, right here records um, that I haven't even listened to yet. And they are split up by genre, or by musical style. So this is Beethoven, which means it's classical. Look at this. This is um, the Grateful Dead. Um, oh, and I spent 183 for this double record. This is uh, my international bin. So look at that. So uh, this is a, a German uh, music. Then there's some Japanese music. Um, Arriba! Uh, un canto de... Uh, 40 años Jungle Rhythms Oh that one's amazing Jungle Rhythm Chance Why did I get it? I wonder why I got it Because there's gourds all over the thing right? Look at that I've been making gourd musical instruments for a long time And I have a pretty big gourd collection myself Alright Let's play that one first okay Let me get this going <laughs> There you go Shout out to Record Surplus In Santa Monica I don't know if they're the last record store, but uh, they're pretty freaking awesome. And I found a lot of awesome records for very cheap prices in really good condition. The new belt looks like it's still going strong. Jungle Rhythms. Look at those gourds. How much did I pay for this record? Doesn't have a... Probably 92 cents. Alright. That was awesome, I'm not, but right, we're skipping ahead because we want to get a sense of it all. Whoa, totally different. Flute, I hear some stringed instruments. Okay, I'm skipping ahead because um, like I said, I'm running, I don't have that much time on this. Look at the sky through the record, that is trippy. Look at that, that's freaking cool. Okay, let's drop it here. Ooh, perfect drop! Perfect drop! Perfect drop! The background's not CG. It's not a green screen, that's the desert back there. We're in the desert! Okay, last track. Get that needle close. It doesn't matter. My hands are a little shaky because I just woke up. I haven't eaten anything and I was messing around the garden. Perfect drop again. <laughs> that could be a thing. I'll make a little graphic. Wow. This was Jungle Rhythms and Chants, Jungle Beat. And let's see, what's the year? 
Wilshire Boulevard, blah, blah, blah. Let's... Right, somewhere it usually says the year. And pause it and find it. Yeah, I realize it probably says it on the record. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, there it is. 1978. Look at that. Yeah. All right, we're going to drop in on. Let me see this. Yeah, Herbie. Herbie Hancock. V S O P. Uh, which I don't even know what that stands for, but do know that this is a double live album Newport Jazz Festival uh, 1976 okay drop it down nice got the crowd thank you very much love a jazz crowd right they clap at the chorus and the solo they're so educated it's freaking amazing about jazz all right, let's look at the record. So, who are we hearing? We're totally hearing Wayne Shorter. Um, I got to see Wayne Shorter and Herbie Hancock at Jazz Fest with Raquel. It was pretty amazing. So Herbie's playing the, the keys. Wayne Shorter's playing that crazy whatever whatever sax whatever horn Ron Carter, Freddie Hubbard, Tony Williams okay this is a great album let's, sorry, let's go back earlier just to get a taste little avant-garde here let's flip it over i mean i hate to minimize the music like this or, or whatever you know jump through it but this is just to get a sense of it that's that's what and and i'll go more depth in in other videos where i focus on only one album it's really, it's really a, a great pleasure and thrill to play with these friends of mine that listen to herbie for many years now listen to herbie 1976 40 uh, two years ago. First of all, let me introduce you to them. Starting off. Here's another track on the uh, side two of four. This is, it's still wild, but man, you got this killer walking kind of bass line. You got like that bop, 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 bop. This is the kind of stuff that I groove on. All right, sometimes it gets fuzzy, right? Is that because my needle needs to be changed or it gets dust on it? So, sometimes when it gets fuzzy, I do that and... But you know what? This is, again, it's about discovery. It's not necessarily for me, it's not about sound quality. Although, I can blast it! I just got it set to Unity and these speakers go crazy! I'm excited about this channel, I have so many records. Um, and I want to just catalog them all, you know, uh, it's just going to be, Hey, look at this record. Look at this record. Just a little, a bit about it. They're neat. All of my awesome fun records. They need to have a place on the internet where people, um, can discover them. Like I've discovered them. If you know what to search for, then maybe, you know, you might, or might not appreciate these reviews but if you just like my channel and you end up liking me and then every so often there's a new video and you're like ah oh, I never even heard of that you know and maybe you can find these on the internet maybe you can't um, I'm sure you can find digital copies of all the stuff you don't need to get the the, the uh, uh, vinyl it's not about that it's about the music and discovery and welcome to my channel Scotty's record room and we're in the desert we're literally in the desert so uh, thanks for watching Hit subscribe, and uh, there's like a bell uh, symbol, or at least in 2018, there's a bell symbol, and if you push that button, then you'll get messages um, when I upload videos. So, thank you very much.